some of the initial studies. They did seem to hint that maybe light to moderate drinkers had a slightly lower chance of heart problems. Sounds well, pretty good, right? Like maybe that little bit Cabernet we did or was doing some good, but, and this is a big but, here's where things get a bit more, let's say, nuanced. And honestly, more interesting too. When researchers started digging a bit deeper, factoring in other parts of people's lives, like their overall diet, how much they exercise, even things like income level, well, a lot of the supposed benefits started to uh, kind of evaporate, like a spilled glass of wine on a hot sidewalk, you know. There was a pretty significant study actually published in JAMA Network Open back in 2022. And what it basically found was that those heartburgs people associated with moderate drinking, they were much more likely connected to just a generally healthier lifestyle overall. Not really the wine itself. I mean, think about it, right? Someone who enjoys maybe one glass of wine with a nice meal, it might also be the kind of person who eats a lot of fresh food, gets regular exercise, manages stress, generally takes care of himself. So was it the vino or was it the whole, uh, the whole shebang? The evidence is leaning more and more towards the whole lifestyle package. 